long ago and far away, a beautiful woman named Belle befriended a beast who lived in an enchanted castle. Now that castle is alive with activity in preparation for a special event. There is much work to be done. You've arrived just in time. Oh, a guest! Oh, how exciting! Belle will be so glad to see you. Lumiere Cogsworth, this is wonderful. You're sure the Beast doesn't know we're planning a surprise party for him? We have maintained the utmost secrecy. I adore surprise parties. They're so surprising. And so much work. We've got to prepare the ballroom, set the table, create the invitations. Oh, settle down, Cogsworth. You're getting yourself all wound up again. Lumiere is right, Cogsworth. Everything will be fine. Quelle chance! Visitors! Help has arrived! This is perfect! With your help, we'll get ready for the party in no time. And then, once the ball starts, you can be our guest! Well, let's get ticking then. Time is of the essence. Allow us to show you around our <laughs> humble abode. There's fun to be had in every room of the castle. Simply click on the door and in you go. Go ahead and explore the kitchen, the ballroom, the library, and the garden. There are different things to do in every room. But remember to stay away from the west wing. The master must not be disturbed. Belle, the secret passages. Oh, that's right. Be sure to keep your eyes open for secret passages. They'll take you from one room to another. And when you're ready to leave a room, just click on the magic mirror and you'll come back here to the foyer. When you're ready to leave the castle entirely, return here to the foyer and click on the mirror. So, select a room and away we will go. Welcome to the garden. This is where the beautiful stained glass windows in the castle are created. We can make art, create new windows, or even write party invitations for our friends. Each time you come back here, you'll be able to see the latest artwork you've created. Why don't you join me? If you want to paint a picture, choose a background here. If you'd like to make a stained glass window, choose a design here. Once you've created a stained glass window, click here to light it up. To add pictures to your backgrounds, choose a sticker here. If you'd like to make party invitations, click on the card. To see one of your drawings, click on a color tag. To start a new drawing, click on a white tag. To clear the page, click on the paper holder. If you want to erase what you just did, click on the feather. When you're ready to print, click here. If you want to go back to the foyer, click here. Be as creative as you want. I can hardly wait to see your work. Fantastic! That's a wonderful picture! New page.
Would you like to go back inside? If so, click again on the mirror. If you'd like to stay out here, click anywhere else. Bye-bye. I'll see you soon. There you are. <laughs> You've done excellent work so far, but we are not finished yet. There are still a few rooms to prepare. There there is so much to do before the dance can begin. We'd better get ticking. Oh, Bell knows dozens of dances. There is nothing to worry about. Well, we know a few dances, but I want this to be special. We need to decorate the ballroom, pick out the right outfits and instruments, and create a special new dance for the big surprise party. Oh, maybe our friend can help. Good idea, Lumiere. Would you help me get the ballroom ready for the surprise party? And when you're done, we can put it all together. Click here to choose my ball gown. Click here to choose the steps for the dance. Click here to prepare the music. When you're all finished, you can click on the doors behind me to start the dance. If you'd like to leave the ballroom, click on the magic mirror. Shall we? There's no time to lose. Woohoo! Well, hello there! What should we dress you in for the surprise party? Let's see what I've got in my drawers. <laughs> Choose a dress to see the whole outfit. If you like it, click on the picture of Belle to select it and return to the ballroom. Let's take a closer look. Oh, that dress is so beautiful! Oh, wonderful choice! I can't wait to see her at the ball! I love the dress you've chosen. Once we choose the instruments and the dance moves for the ball, we'll be ready to go. Choose the chair to prepare the music, or click on the dance floor to select the steps for the dance. And now, mon ami, help create a dance for the master and Belle. Just choose a tile and place it on the ballroom floor, starting here. To have the master and bell step to the right, place the step tile to the right of the start square. For the master and bell to step to the left, place the step tile to the left of the start square. You get the idea? To have the master twirl bell in a circle, put this tile onto the dance floor. If you would like to have the master dip bell in a romantic fashion, put this tile onto the dance floor. I taught him this move myself. To make them spin in a circle, put this tile onto the dance floor. If you'd like the master and bell to fan out to the side, put this tile onto the dance floor. These moves take two, and these take only one. I'll let you know when you only have a few steps left. This banner will show you all the moves you have added to your dance. That way you can put more than one move on a tile, if you'd like, without losing track of what steps you are taking. If you decide you'd like to start over, just click on that irresistible feather duster to reset the dance floor. When you're finished, click here. What are you waiting for? It's time to make some magic happen on the dance floor. Excellent choice! Surely you've taken some ballroom dancing classes, hmm? I'm afraid there is not enough time for that move. Try one of these. If you are sure you want to start over, click again. Use one of these moves to end your dance. I'm afraid there is not enough time for that move. Try one of these. Use one of these moves to end your dance. If you are... A wonderful combination. What exquisite taste. You have completed the dance. It is a work of art. What are you waiting for? It's time to make some magic happen on the dance floor! My, those moves will look so nice together. 
Let's go back to the ballroom to finish choosing the instruments and my dress for the ball. How exciting! All we need now is the music. Click on the chair to prepare the music. Click on any musician to hear him play an instrument. Click on a musician again to change his instrument. Each musician can play one of three different instruments. Oh, what talented fellows! Once you've selected instruments for all of the musicians, click on the sheet music. Click on any of them to get started. Delightful sound. A lovely melody. It will do very nicely for the party. Thank you. Oh, the master will be quite pleased with this selection. Lovely selection. Our musicians will remember the instruments you've chosen and get them ready for the ball. That was wonderful. The Beast has no idea we're planning a surprise party. Maybe we should go back to the foyer to see what else needs to be done. Click on the magic mirror to return to the foyer or click anywhere else. If you'd like to return to the foyer, see you soon. There you are! <laughs> You've done excellent work so far, but we are not finished yet. There are still a few rooms to prepare. Mrs. Potts? Mama! Mama! What is it, Chip? We need to get ready for the party. But look who's here! Oh, hello, love. Chip and I were just setting the table for the master's party. We have different settings for tea, dinner and dessert. There's so much to do. Would you be a dear and help us? To see how you would do it, look under the plate cover over there. All you have to do is move the dishes and their contents from the cupboard shelves to the table in the right order. Just click on an item to move it down to the placemat. We'll need four place settings for each course. <laughs> and it gets harder with each course. For tea, you only need five pieces, but for dessert, you need seven. Oh, and try not to break anything, okay? Click on the plate cover to change the course you want to build. Good luck, dear. Click on the timer to begin, or to return to the foyer, click on the magic mirror. Let's go! Complete.
You did it. And it all looks so grand. I couldn't have done it without you. To change to a new corner. Dear, we've got to hurry. Oh, my, what fine work! That setting is complete. Splendid! Oh dear, oh dear. Well done! You're a regular speed demon, you are. Fine work! Lumiere, can you come here, please? Yes? Oh, what an elegant table! All it needs is atmosphere! a little while then. Toodaloo. Oh dear, the master will awaken soon. Good thing there is only one room left to prepare. Bonjour, mon ami. We are so happy to see you. We need your expert help on a matter of great mystery. Perhaps I should explain the conundrum. In order to surprise the master, we must enter the West Wing. Unfortunately, he has hidden the key in one of these books. Only Cogsworth doesn't remember which book it's hidden behind. I wrote it down in secret code. Secret even to you! Come closer, and we'll explain how to find the key to the West Wing. I need you to choose questions about the book where the key is hidden. I'll find the answer from the secret codes, then you can eliminate the books that do not fit the answer. For example... Click on the Book of Clues. And I will ask you, is it a blue book? And I will answer. If I say yes, you can rule out all the books that are not blue by clicking on the red stripe on the book covers. If I say no, it is not a blue book, then you can dispose of all the blue books. But guess wisely. 
Speaking of guesses, you may, if you wish, try to guess which book is the mystery book by clicking on the green stripe. But be careful. If you guess incorrectly, you lose a clue. This is precisely why I advise you to guess wisely. We only have a limited number of questions. You can tell how many clues you have by looking at the roses. If they are red, you can still ask more questions. And at each level, you will need to identify the mystery book to get a section of the key. Once you complete all three levels, we will have the complete key to the West Wing. If you want to change the level, click here. If you want to go back to the foyer, click here. Let's get started then, shall we? Is this character playing an instrument by any chance? Yes, this character is holding an instrument. Very interesting. <laughs> Click here to turn the page for the next clue. Ah, it is blue. Well done. Question. The character on the book, does it have big teeth? Uh, um, uh, yes, there are teeth. Big ones, too. Are you certain? So, you think... Well done! We are on our way! You have found the first piece of the key. Well done! This level can be tricky. Here we go! Level 2. Is the background red? Alas, no. I'm afraid not. Is the background yellow? Yes, it is yellow. Excellent work. Click here to turn the page for the next clue. Is this character playing an instrument by any chance? Yes, this character is holding an instrument. Very interesting. <laughs> we have only three questions left. Click here to turn the page for the next clue. Is this character wearing a jacket? Sorry, Lumiere, no jacket. Mon ami, we have but two questions left. The character on the book, does it have big teeth? No, it does not have big teeth. Oui, oui, we have arrived at our final question. Does it have wings? No, there are no wings, apparently. So, knock me down. Two down, one to go. Splendid! You have found the second section of the key. 
the toughest level by far. You can do it. Level three. Click here to turn the page for the next clue. Is this character wearing a jacket? Sorry, Lumiere, no jacket. Don't worry. Is this character playing an instrument by any chance? Oh dear, there is no musical instrument here. What a waste. We have only three questions left. Is the background red? No, this is not it. Regrettable. Mon ami, we have but two questions left. Does it have wings? Mm, mm, let me see. Uh, yes, this character has wings. Oui, oui, we have arrived at our final question. Does this character have big ears? Alas, not at all. It does not have big ears. Are you... The key is ours! Magnificent! You found the key! Très bien! Let's follow that key to the West Wing. You have completed all the activities in preparation for the Master's party, and it is time to get ready to surprise him. Congratulations! We are all ready for the big surprise party. I knew you could do it. Now, click on the West Wing to surprise the Master. Oh boy, here he comes, Mama. Keep it down, dear. Oh no, he'll hear you. Shh! Surprise! <laughs> A surprise party from me? So tell us, were you surprised? I never suspected a thing. Thank you. Just as I said all along, we could pull it off without a hitch. I thought you'd wake up when we were cooking, but Mama said you'd sleep right through it. Oh, no, Chip. <laughs> well, sir, there is a young lady here with a request. May I have the first dance? It would be my pleasure. And believe it or not, they lived happily ever after.